Welcome everyone, this is James Ryan. is going to bring you, special ladies and gentlemen, a new video today. I am excited about the journey of this channel. I did purchase a new laptop and I am excited because I could record a higher quality and I could edit faster now and at, make it more productive. When I do edit videos, I can just do it on my laptop without doing it on my phone because I used to edit videos on my phone because that was quicker and better and cleaner to do than my old laptop I had for seven plus years. So I had to make that change. I had, you know, I had to put a little investment in the growth that I want to see through this channel. So well, without further ado, let's talk about the main subject of this video. The main subject of this video is I get this question asked a lot, whether it's on Facebook, random people I meet, um, non-vegans, Instagram, YouTube, whatnot. It's what's the most challenging thing about being vegan or what I've experienced the most challenging things. It depends. It depends on the timeline of me being a vegan. At first, like my first few months, it was what the most challenging thing was what are the things I need to eat to for me to sustain and grow a healthy body and a strong body that was the hardest thing for me experimenting with foods and seeing which which things work which food products plant-based uh, products work best for me that was a huge challenge but I was lucky enough to experiment and see which work which things work best for me and that was implementing a lot of sweet potatoes in my diet having a lot more raw greens uh, fruits uh, pea protein was amazing, adding lentils, adding quinoa, adding black beans, an assortment of beans, sunflower seeds. Those are the main things that I, you know, didn't usually implement to my diet and I had to try it out and see how it worked for me. And it's worked great. Um, if you ask me now, what's the most challenging thing for me is uh, sometimes, you know, your friends or family want to want you to join them to eat out somewhere and that's the most challenging thing because there's a lot of, there's limited places that you know meat eaters like that have a vegan friendly option so I think that's the most challenging thing so usually when I go out you know I choose a place and then I'm like you guys want to meet me here and go eat there's very limited places around here that have you know vegan options or they do have vegan options but it's pretty small Luckily, that scene is growing and more and more places are opening. So, those problems will be soon be solved. But I do like eating out you know, on the weekend sometimes and just finding that right place and just trying new things is, you know, kind of hard and kind of challenging. But if that's the least, that that's the most I have to worry about, you know, being a vegan. Whether I, you know, I, I could just cook my own food and be happy with that, but just going out and eating that social experience, if that's what the thing I have to worry about, I'm fine because you know, I'm saving animals' lives, I'm helping the earth, I'm benefiting my health. So, those things mask that challenge triple fold, tenfold, a thousand fold in my eyes. So, if you're a vegan, what's the most challenging things that you have to overcome or things that you are trying to do or if you're trying to make that transition be to be a vegetarian or you're trying to make you've been a vegetarian for a while and trying to make that leap to become vegan what, what's what's holding you back or what's challenging you or, or just what's challenging you in your diet in your exercising just what's challenging you in your life leave it down below if you do have if you want to answer that question and hopefully you guys enjoy the new setup or the new you know experience it's kind of gloomy outside that's why it's kind of dim in here but I love you guys thanks for joining thanks for viewing stay awesome this has been James Rise and I will see you guys soon enough till next time